Hello there and welcome to BeNetTV.com. I'm Michelle Sklar. We're down here at the Consumer Electronics Show in Las Vegas and we are checking out the hottest products. And I'm here speaking with Bill Jahl of On2. Hi, Michelle. Hi, nice to meet you. Yeah, Thanks great. for taking the time to speak with us today. Great, thank you. Now, for viewers that are joining us for the first time, tell us about Onto. Okay, Onto is a video technology company. The company's been around since 1992. Uh, we basically uh, provide a number of video compression technologies. Um, about three years ago, we licensed video technologies to Adobe Macromedia for Flash. So if you look at most of the today's user-generated content sites, they're powered by our technology. Uh, we also licensed our technology to Skype. So if you look at uh, Skype video, uh, it's our technology. And then last year we made an acqu acquisition of a Finnish company called Hantro, and they provided us the rest of the technologies from uh, H.264, VC1, H.263. So we became a multi-format codec company uh, by the end of last year. What we're announcing at the show here is uh, our software uh, multi-format decoder. It basically supports the flash uh, profiles for uh, Sorens and Spark, VP6, We've also added in H.264, hence it's bringing in the, uh, the best of the two companies together. Right, right. So who are you marketing your product to? That's depending on the different market segments. So we market uh, the flash to the user-generated content sites, the broadcasters, and then everyone that wants to put content into flash. And then on the device side, because people want to take this content and look at it on mobiles and want to look at it on TV, so then we market to the device manufacturers, or the chip manufacturers, who end up putting this content, uh, putting the codecs onto the various right, devices. Right, right. Now, of course, as the evolution of the technologies um, has vastly grown over the last several years, at the same time, so is the ability for a person to quickly learn and be able to take advantage of these technologies. It used to be the case where you needed to, you know, pay a graphic designer, you know, tens of thousands of dollars or a web builder to build your website. Times have really changed. So the, the learning curve for being able to use the, the codecs and such for your video compression technology, what, what's that like? Is this something that's geared more towards a professional or someone who perhaps is wanting to kind of get into creating videos and, and having <coughs> them operate on devices? It's the full range. So, I mean, if you look at uh, what's happening with social networking, people can uh, re encode video on their cell phones and send it on up. So that's made it very easy for right. For, from that, uh, for, for a user perspective. We, from a company perspective, are also providing tools that help the consumers edit and create videos and then be able to become self-publishers. So you'll see announcements where we allow, you know, uh, you know uh, sports teams that want to publish their own videos and be able to share it with the universities and schools. You'll, you'll see us providing tools for that. So the, you know, the idea is to make it easier. The other dimension is to move to high definition. So you want to look at that so content. My next question. Oh, okay. Absolutely, absolutely. <laughs> Let's talk about HD. There's a lot of debates happening right now. Six months ago, HD was all the rage. Now we're talking about Blu-ray. How do you position yourself between those different formats, or really does it matter for the uh, type of technologies for, you're providing? For for our for us, it doesn't matter because if you look at let's. You know, we're looking at high definition on the internet, so if you look at Adobe and Flash, you know, with our VP6 codec, it's high definition on the internet. Then when you look at Skype, we're doing high definition 720p, that's high definition on the internet. And then when you look at the device side, whether you're talking about Blu-ray or you're talking about cell phones or you're talking about cameras, because of our Hantro piece, we actually provide the technology to those chipsets to be able to support uh, high definition. So, you know, being a multi-format codec player, we're playing in all the video devices. Right, and so for, for at this point, it's really been the HD that's been the main focus that you're entering into the market with right now, with those opportunities for people to format their videos so that they're HD. That's that's really what's happened yeah. uh, at this at this show is we are delivering HD products. Fantastic. And how do we get access to your products? www.onto.com. Fantastic. Thanks a lot for hanging out and chatting with us today. We appreciate that. We're here at the Consumer Electronics Show. We've been speaking with Onto's Bill Joel. And I'm Michelle Sklar with BNETTV.com.